For paramedics, when responding to emergencies, every second counts. When you see an ambulance or other emergency vehicle traveling with lights and sirens, you're required by law to pull over and yield. Emergency vehicles include British Columbia Emergency Health Service ambulances and response vehicles, and also includes police vehicles and fire trucks. Emergency vehicles that are displaying flashing lights and sirens always have the right of way by law. An ambulance traveling with lights and sirens means that paramedics are responding to a medical or traumatic event where someone's life may be at risk. Every minute counts and can affect patient outcomes. Here's what to do when you see or hear an emergency vehicle coming. On any two-way road or undivided highway, all traffic moving in both directions must pull over to the closest curb and stop. And remember, this includes cyclists and pedestrians. Never block the route of an emergency vehicle and never stop in an intersection. On a divided highway or one-way road, pull over to either the left or right side of the roadway to create a clear access lane in the center for emergency vehicles. When in doubt, the best thing is to pull over safely to the right and stop. Always use your signal light when you're about to pull over. This tells the driver of the emergency vehicle that you see them coming and you plan to pull over to the side of the road in which you are indicating. And please, never just slam on the brakes and stop. Once the emergency vehicle has passed, watch and listen. Multiple response vehicles may be involved. Never pull back onto the roadway without checking first that there are no more emergency response vehicles approaching. Always be aware of your surroundings and the possibility of encountering an emergency vehicle. Practice safe driving by always scanning your mirrors. You may see an emergency vehicle coming well before you hear it. Know the rules and follow the law so that our paramedics and other emergency responders can help keep you and other British Columbians safe.